Hi guys, Luna here, back with another Lords of the Fallen Weapons and Armors Guide video. In this one, I'm showing you how to unlock all the game's weapons and armors that are dropped by the game's bosses. Once defeated, every boss has a set of armor, weapons, and magic that you can then purchase and equip for your character. And as you would expect, they are some of the best gear in game. But there are some stages to unlocking this. Let's begin. First, play through the game until you reach this area here, Pilgrim's Perch Descent. Here you can head along the path and follow the ladders down. There's really only one way to go here, so you cannot miss this, but you'll come across this section here where the ladder drops off an edge. Activate Umbriel and a new platform will appear with lots of enemies and you can defeat them. And there is Soulfly here to release that will drop an item called the Bowl of Revelations. You can now take this back to Molhu in the Sanctuary, and he will now offer Remembrances. Ah, a key to shadowed halls of the past. Their delight's now yours to indulge in, bearer of the lamp. Remembrances are dropped from every major boss fight, like this one here from Payetta, the first boss you come across in-game. Offer her Remembrance, and now a set of items will become available. But to buy them, you will need Umbral Scow Rings, which are dropped from the fragments of the past that you come across all over the game, and each fragment will drop two Scow Rings if you watch them. So that is how you purchase every boss gear in Lords of the Fallen, and how to buy them as well. And they will become available, now that you have the Bolo Revelations, as soon as you defeat the boss. Guys, like and subscribe for more guides. I'm working on a video for all weapons and armors for Pilgrim's Perch Descent, including one of the game's best armor pieces. So like and subscribe for more, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.